Hi everyone. Today I'd like to introduce this really cool Almond C mixer. This is Photon's new generation of MA5 platform right side drive pure electric mixer. This vehicle is equipped with a motor developed by Photon and the motor torque is between 1300 and 2500 Nm. The 282 kilowatt per hour battery is from CATL and we've also equipped it with dual charging interface for fast charging which can be fully charged in just one hour. And if it's a battery swap that you choose, you only take five minutes. Let's have a look at the power switch for the entire vehicle. Now first, this power switch has two states, both vertical and horizontal. If you wish to be driving or charging the vehicle, the switch needs to be turned to state. And if you're done driving for the day and you want to park the vehicle, then you should change the state to vertical. It's really that easy. Now this is the charging interface, which as you can see, supports dual power nozzle charging. But before you start the charge, you want to make sure that there are no foreign objects inside the structure. And once that's done, you can turn the power switch on to begin charging. When charging is done, you put the rubber covers back on the interface and you close the door. Here's an instruction on how to use the vehicle. First, shift the gear to neutral. Next, apply the handbrake. And then you turn the key to the on position. And after the self-check on the instrument panel is complete, press the brake and do not release it. Then turn the key to the start gear. And until the light on the instrument panel indicates a successful start. Below, is an introduction of the cab switches, including the headlight height adjustment switch, rear view mirror heating switch, cab looping switch, and rear view mirror adjustment switch. The air conditioning control panel, wheel differential lock switch, uphill assist switch, anti-slip switch, switch between electric horn and air horn, and interaxle differential locksmith. Power lock, power windows, passenger window lock switch. You also have a multimedia screen control switch, phone on and off switch, cruise control switch, instrument panel menu and page switching. This is our gear lever. R is reverse, N is neutral, A is automatic, M is manual. The plus sign is an upshift of manual gear, and negative sign is a downshift of manual gear. EP is the power and economy mode switch, and C is a climbing gear. Introduction to the use of the concrete mixing tanks. There are three operating modes the first of which is the central control screen operating mode in the driver's cab. The second mode of operation for the rear control panel of the vehicle body. The third is the remote control mode. Now the following is an introduction to the usage of the central control screen. Before using the central control screen, the vehicle must be started first. Now when the ready light is on, it indicates that it has already been started. You press the feeding button the tank will run at a speed of two revolutions per minute. Set the tank speed, the actual speed, the low voltage storage battery voltage, speed increase, and the speed decrease. Also stop, discharge switch, and initial speed of two revolutions per minute, discharge chute rise switch, and the lowering switch of the discharge chute. If the central control screen is switched off, other switches are failed. This is the fast mixing switch, and when you press this button, the tank will quickly mix at a speed of 10 revolutions per minute. Before using, it is necessary to ensure that the gear lever is in neutral and the handbrake is pulled up. This is an introduction to the use of the rear control panel, including power switch, feeding, speed increase and decrease. You can set the speed and actual speed. 
In addition to these two buttons that can be operated, this knob can also be used to discharge, decrease or increase speed, and in an emergency, stop button. Press this button to stop the tank. Before using, it is necessary to ensure that the gear lever is in neutral and the handbrake is pulled up. Also ensure that the rear control panel is on. Here's an introduction to the use of the remote control power switch. Feeding, increasing, and decreasing speed. Stopping discharging, battery power of the remote control, set tank body speed, working status of the tank body, stopping, remote control, backlight on, backlight off, sliding shoot up, sliding shoot down, and shut down. The effective distance of the remote control can reach tens of meters. This is the unique concrete intelligent weighing system equipped with load sensors which can convert the weight of the concrete into cubic meters and display it into real time on the screen. Here you only need to input the density of the concrete and select the type of the concrete and then it will automatically calculate the weight and the volume of the concrete in the pouring body and display the result on the screen. This is the water pressure control box, which consists of two parts. The first part is the pressure gauge, and the pressure gauge pointer should work in the green area. The second part is the operating handle. When we need to add water to the system, we turn the handle to the pressure reducing position, and wait for the pressure to release, open the inlet valve, and connect the inlet pipe, and then close the inlet valve after adding water. When the cleaning function needs to be used, the handle needs to be turned to the pressured position. This is the water valve. Open the valve to add water to the mixing tank and close the valve to stop the water. This is a high pressure cleaning water gun. When using the water gun, remove the water gun and open the valve to use it. It should be noted that when using a high pressure water gun to clean the vehicle body, it's vitally important to avoid washing our electrical components, such as the electrical control box, the charging box, and high voltage battery box. This is a vibrator, which can make the concrete discharge smoother and prevent the accumulation of material in the discharging chute. Now you open the valve to turn it on, and you close the valve to turn it off. It has a maximum capacity of 31 tons, including eight cubic meters of concrete and the dry mixing tank. It has a length of 9.37 meters, a width of 2.59 meters, and a height of 3.69 meters, with a wheelbase of two meters by 2.85 meters and 1.35 meters. Let's go over some of the benefits of the Photon Almond C. It has low operating costs. It has a lightweight body. It has low carbon and zero emissions. It's safe to use. It's convenient to operate. It has diversified energy replenishment. And it's a comfortable drive. These are just some of the surprises that Photon E Almond C Mixer has brought to you. Have we teased you enough? Have we piqued your curiosity? Be in contact with our professionals at Photon to find out more. Photon. Easy move.